Now we've got an update to a story that's exploded across the internet. This man had a very arresting moment with an alligator while running from the cops. Today he was in court, still bearing some of the scars, and he just talked with our own Fox 13's Josh Cassio from jail. Josh, I bet he said it hurt. Yeah, Mark, I'll tell you what, it was certainly a very interesting interview. Brian Zuniga was very open with us, very forthcoming. He says he's speaking out because he doesn't want folks to think he's a bad guy. He admits he made a mistake and he paid a hefty price. He, of course, talked about the alligator attack, saying he was in the water swimming, hiding from deputies. He was about to get out when a six to eight foot alligator came up, lunged at him. At that point, he said he was in the fight of his life. Take a listen. I thought I was going to die. Um, the moment that the gator's mouth hit my head, I almost got knocked out unconscious, but my will to fight for my life kept me uh, um, conscious, and I fought the gator back. He says he fought back with one arm and two legs. He says one arm and his head uh, were in the alligator's mouth. As you see, he does have a number of stitches, but he looks to be okay. Of course, the big question is, why did he run? Well, he says... He didn't realize it was a deputy at first. He thought someone may have been tailing him, so he says he ultimately ran. He says by the time he realized it was a cop, he decided it was too late and kept on going. He certainly regrets doing that, he says.